So I've been running around doing all the different things that pop up that are like, Hey, kill some time, go over here, do this thing. And one of them sent me back here. Uh, mostly I'm running around because I'm waiting for this damn thing. But I guess I probably need to do this in order to make this happen. I don't know. But anyway, I got a call that was like, yo, come to the main unit, the reactor area, and fight a bunch of guys up here. And I was like, okay, fought them, killed them, saved the day as usual. And then remembered how cool this thing was. and was like, look at this. What does that mean? And then I saw this. And now everything I know is totally out of whack. I don't know what means what anymore. I... So the first head of the bureau, the first director is in there? That's what this is? I have questions. I have more questions now. That gave me an answer. And now I have more questions, and none of it seems to really be helpful. But, uh... All right, to the Panopticon we go. Not looking forward to it. It, uh, seems terrifying. But... We'll find out. We'll find out together. Okay, where the hell is it? Where, where the hell am I going? Am I going back to... Let's go Central Executive... And take the elevator? <laughs> take the elevator to the Panopticon! You know? It'll be fine. Do you think anyone else has anything important to tell me? Are they it's gonna like... Ridiculous. What is? Oh, grasping at straws. Why? If his is a frequency, then why couldn't it vibrate molecules in order to alter the human physiology? It would explain the hair loss. Think about it. The precision that would require is unthinkable. These two are low-key the best characters in this game. <laughs> Just think about it. Oh, hey. Got something, got something to chat with me about? Hi, Jesse. Hello. Uh, no. Okay, well, this has I been fun. Be Bye. Enjoy your data. Oh, I will. Wow, oh, I love you so much. Okay. Guess that's it. Let's go find I Dylan. other species would verbalize. Okay, where are we going? Containment sector? Is that it? I guess so. I'm ready to see some weird things. Like, I'm ready to get... Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, mister! Let me see the other version of you's thing about this. containment sector, the Panopticon, is home to the altered items we find and contain. It is a maximum security prison. It's a vault for the most valuable treasures on Earth. It's a powder keg big enough to blow this world to dust. A temple, a place of worship filled with idols of angry gods. It's all of these, and none of them. It's something more profound, unbelievable, unknowable, something worse. Altered items, we've found many. They appear mundane, but nothing could be further from the truth. They are all powerful, dangerous. They press heavy on our minds because that's their nature. They've been altered because we can't stop thinking about them. We put them on altars because they're used to being worshipped. This keeps them calm. We contain them, but they don't want to be controlled. We study them to discover what makes them tick. If this place were ever breached, it would be chaos of biblical portions well swell just just what is the other version of you have to say in sector panopticon altered items maximum security prison dangerous 
What a weird photo to include with everything else. Oh, is that the first reactor? I have so many questions. All right, well, and then me looking fabulous. Logistics, medical wing, security, Panopticon. That's where we're leading. Everything's headed there, and frankly, I'm not okay with it. Are you going to become a thing? I like how at this point I'm just looking for lore. Finally found it. Not excited for it. It's going to be awful. <laughs> All this lore leading up to... What was I just saying? What the shit? Let me grab this emergency phone because they're going to need an ambulance. Oh! <laughs> I didn't think it was going to explode, but I can think of a way to put out a fire. You think these jokes are bad? Take it up with the board. <laughs> I need to stop. <laughs> oh, can I get this guy? Come on, buddy. There you go. Now I got a big one on my side. It's time now. Yeah, get him, dude. Take that chair back. Thank you. That was my chair. I'm going to take it back. <laughs> They're trying. They're trying real hard. Anyone else? Oh, my God. Uh, We're going to need the janitor. This place is a mess. Hello. While altered items and objects of power may seem similar at first, it's important to note very key distinctions. Thank you. Firstly, objects of power grant para-utilitarian abilities. Secondly, objects of power translocate anyone who makes physical contact to the astral plane. This is widely believed to be due to the blank's affiliation with the objects of power. Not every individual is allowed in the astral plane, which indicates the blank evaluates who can and cannot enter. Thirdly, this is not always the case. Objects of power are much more paranaturally blank than altered items. Looking at the specific criteria that defines an object of power, it is no wonder they are notably rarer than altered items. In fact, we have blank altered items for every object of power contained within the Bureau. Interesting little bit of background. Is there more? Oh, God, that was my own guy. His head exploded. Hmm, anything else? Ooh. That music faded in and out and not in a good way. And like a real creepy certificate of achievement for service from 1987 what year is it okay mm again the weird containment thing which makes me think now it's connected with the oh, man you find one little bit of information and suddenly your worldview changes too real uh oh here we go reminder this week, any documents that suddenly appear pink, light red, or any shade in between must be incinerated immediately. Failure to do so will result in termination and possible bodily harm. Thank you for your attention. Like an evil pink slip? <laughs> like an evil pink slip thing? Am I going to have to worry about that now? Oh my god. Okay. I don't want to have to worry about that now, but here... Also, devil plant. I'm catching on. I'm catching on. They aren't supposed to be here yet. Here they are. Is there anything this? No. Okay. Let's go towards the weird yellow thing. Oh, it's a shelter. No mushrooms in here, we're good. 
No spores, no weirdness. All right. There's always going to be weirdness. That's a fact. Remote thought. Ah, yes. I'm just collecting echoes and remote thoughts, and uh, that's nice. Weird light source. Okay, so we have a split here. Nope, no we don't. It's the same thing. <laughs> Thought for sure we're going to two different locations, but it is... Shit. Okay, let's grab a seat. And uh, we'll... Take out the trash. And, uh, give him something to hold on to. Oh, no, more coming. Another chair. And another. Oh, just one single seat. He doesn't need any more. I'm going to take Rocket Man. No, Rocket Man, I'm your friend. Oh, ooh, shit, maybe it's this guy. So many rockets, so little time. Are we good? Oh! The answer was no. The answer was no. Anyone else that can throw chairs at? I have a few more chair related puns. No? Okay. I was trying to be charitable <laughs> with my puns. Okay. Get out of here, rectangles. Save your blocks for Legos. I got stuff to do. Nice. All right. I guess now I can explore this area. Whoa! That's some lore bits that I'm going to take a minute to look at, but first, where the hell did I come from? Up here? Yes, yes, I did, didn't I? Okay, oh, that's glass. Ran into it like a damn bird. <laughs> men's room? Excuse me, men's room, do you have lore? Or working toilets, because where the street is, they ain't working. I assume this is ladies? Oh, nope, this is the mail room. Ladies, do your bathroom. What? Wait, what? Where's the ladies' room? Why is that important to me? What? <laughs> Wait a minute. Where's the ladies' room? Is it over here? Do you have to go to the opposite hall? Oh, what do you do? Damn it, I did it again! <laughs> Who's the bird now? <laughs> okay, maybe... Maybe this is fine. Mm hmm. All right, so I'm kind of mapping out this area. And then we have another door that leads to, I assume, another weird area. Swe swell, okay. This place is huge. I need. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God, it's so big. Oh, what the shit was. Fellas, 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 not even cool. Ow, 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 okay, ow, I just want to control your friend. Shoot them, shoot her! Oh, there we go. Jump down here and collect all this. What the hell? Not in the computer room. This stuff is expensive. guys with their rockets. Who let them in here? Okay, so we have numbers associated with locations. I'm not sure what it means, though. And then computer terminals. Ordinary. That's her town. 
9714. Maybe that's where he's being kept? Or maybe the item that brought him here? The weird projector? 9714? Would that... Might as well go section to section, right? There is... Oh my god, so much redacted nonsense. Okay. I'm the director, y'all. My clearance level's through the roof. Why don't you just tell me things? Help me out here. What is this? Redacted, redacted, terrifying smiley face. Okay, well, I'm cursed now. We have another room with another one of these. But nothing really special. And then... Main room? And then... Back side room? That leads kind of... To the main room. And then to the stairs that lead up to the bathroom. Okay. Mapping out this area is happening. And I went around that way, so... We're good. With that. Alright. Let's go over to this part. Hello? There's the stairs. Does it take me to a back area? Ooh. Anything. Any information. Really crappy oil painting? Cowboys? What? Horowitz? Hello? Someone needs help over there. He can wait his ass. I got shit to <laughs> I got stuff to get. Sounds like there's a man down. Yeah, okay, I get it, but calm yourself. I can get into these places now. Thank you very much. Nice, I'll take both. Oh boy, here we go. For some time now, there has been a steady increase in the annual number of AWEs that the Bureau responds to. Between 2010 and 2015, we responded to blank AWEs. For comparison, note that we only responded to blank between 1995 and 2005. Is this rise the result of blank? Improvement in our detection procedures? Or perhaps simply coincidence? We cannot say for sure. Which is why this proposal for an AWE task can't even speak AWE task force to be created within the hierarchy of the investigation sector has been compiled. We need to spend more time examining what causes AWEs rather than just containing them. That's probably true. Also, it was like, hey, you could access this, but it was just wanting me to throw it. This is gonna take me back this way. Definitely is. This is going to take me back. Oh, come on. I didn't even do anything. I didn't even talk to the guy yet. Oh, I need this. Don't worry. Find your friend. I know he went in this room. My dude, not even cool. All right. Watch the hall for me, I guess. So I went into that area here. Got that one thing. That was it, huh? Oh, I guess that. I like how I wanted more. I just... Wanted more. I guess that was my friend dying out there. Go get him, tiger! Alright, so we're back here. This is one of the doors I was looking into. Oh, hello, files. I see you. Pram procedure. Oh, no. Item is a baby carriage with a black shade and steel wire wheels. Left front wheel is slightly bent, causing a distinct wobble when pushed. Item produces smoke incessantly. Smoke density varies. Smoke is generated without apparent fire or ignition source. An incident in Paris in 1979 brought the pram to the attention of the Bureau. Smoke filled an antique store where the pram was being sold, killing the shop's owner. Update! Detailed records of the events leading to the item's discovery were destroyed in an incident in the Panopticon. Interviews with living witnesses were re-performed at the order of the Archives and Records Chief. It's probably just that smoking baby from Who Framed Roger Rabbit. And not at all something terrible. And SCP-like. 
which is my greatest fear of this next area. That's all it's gonna be, just things messing with me. Oh, here he is. I got to as quick as I could. I'm here. What happened to you? I uh, got in a little scrap. Name's Horowitz. I, oh, ah. Is he gonna be okay? Don't look at me like that. I'm fine. But Wells is still in there. You gotta get him out. Who's Wells? My squad mate. We were hunting a runaway altered item. We followed it down into the clocks. The clocks? A threshold. The Bureau sealed it up years back because of all the clocks. Oh no! We, we followed the altered item inside, but the way it was acting, we weren't ready. Me and Wells were the only ones to make it to the motel court. He was right behind me, but he never showed up on this side. I'll go find him. But first, you need to get to a medic. Wells is the medic. Please, you gotta get him out of there. I'll be fine, really. Rook can patch me up later. Fine. But I'll be back for you. I damn well hope so. <laughs> Just use the motel cord there. It should get you into the clocks. Sorry. The threshold. Oh no! Oh no! Well, looks like I'm doing a matter of time now. Cool, cool. So I'm going back into the motel. I did not expect this to happen. I did not at all expect this to happen. Also, do they draw that? Because that's cool as hell looking. Or is that just the way that always looked? And I never noticed. Okay, I'll go in there in one second. Let me explore this area a little bit more. You never know what I could find. Maybe anything of use. Maybe uh, like a note on clocks. Clocks. They're right twice a day. That's not what that's not what that's that's not what that saying is. Jesse, he's like a broken clock. He doesn't work. <laughs> okay, let's do this thing. Uh, F. Hit that F one more time, and what? Every time I do anything, it's like go do this other thing. No. No, clock. The hell? Where's that anime laugh coming from? Like a wicked witch. Uh-huh. And three should do it. It's always three. Oh, we got a new door this time. Nope, it's just door three. Okay. You want me to change the, probably make the clock times match? Is that what it's going to be? Hold on, let me see. What time is it? It's, uh, 11.10. 11.10. Do I press escape when it's at the right time? That's an unfortunate, like, that's not a pleasant laugh. And... Ooh. Oh, I guess that did it? We good? Oh, I saw something on there. Uh... Maybe a key showed up? I guess it wouldn't be a key to the place I need to go. Well, I don't know. Looks like that's done. Is there a clock in this room too? Oh, there's clocks in every room. Gotcha. Okay, and then it's gonna set itself to the right time? Maybe? No, so that's... 115. So do I actually have to get it very close to 115? Oh. Oh, you can just stop it at the right time. Gosh. Come on now. Come on now. And 115. I think. Yeah, okay. 
Good. Oh, look at that. You don't just have to press escape. You can press F2. Understood. Okay. And well, this time I'm pressing 510. <laughs> and yeah. there we go. Escape. Thank you for being... Oh, okay. So I'm going... Are they ever going to open these rooms? I get that I need to go into here. But what are these rooms exactly? Oh, that's the copyright room. You don't want to go in there. That place... It sucks. That's where YouTube's from. Okay. One. Two. And clocks. Uh. This Wells guy can't be far. Doesn't seem like a lot of clocks. Hello? Am I jumping down here? Oh, they're making me jump down here. Hello? What the hell? I don't like the noises I'm hearing. But I especially don't like the fact this room is just a bunch of clocks. Those must be the clocks he was talking about. Can I throw these at people? Cause I'm gonna. All right, so this says camp this way. Oh, here they come. Yuck! You need that. Oh God. I'm gonna f this dude. All right, help me control this sector. Is that it? You can't control this point because you threw away all the equipment needed. You big dummy. Are you Wells? Not no more, you ain't. Okay, so this is their base camp and this is where they're all hanging out. Camping. Weird ass room. I guess this is all kind of the point. This is very, very strange. Any notes? Anything that's like, well, it was weird to camp indoors, but uh, we aren't questioning it. Up we go. So this is all sealed off. This is all sealed off. This seems like a shirt I saw at Abercrombie and Fitch. That's where I do all my shopping. <laughs> I'm sure as you're aware. Are you the one? Nope, he is very dead. That is... I'm sorry, clearance level 9? Who the hell would have that level? Hopefully me as the director, but nope. Clearance level 9? Dear God. Shit. Hello? Yeah, no, he's dead, dude. Oh, there you go. Are you Wells? Your friend asked me to come looking for you. That must be Horowitz. Glad he got out. I stayed back to help the others. Did a shit job of it, clearly. You tried. That's enough. Horowitz needs your help now. How do we get out of here? We should head back through the threshold. We can look for other survivors as we go. We better hurry. Which way? Just follow the blood. Oh my god. Okay. Go. Oh, am I with you? All right, I'm going to escort you in your little jiggle blob you have over your head. Jiggle, 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 blob. I didn't see anything of value. Ooh, wait, hold on. Is that a value? What are you? Nothing. Wait, you have level 9 security clearance? Are you my boss? 
I'm sorry, sir. I will escort you. Wow. What's with the clocks? Threshold effect. This used to be a regular office wing before the threshold manifested. The forces of playing there got a hold of someone's old clock and started duplicating it. Now the office is abandoned and it's clocks all the way down. So did they like ever go out on the date or I feel like she messaged a thing that was like, nope, I don't want to go on a date with you. Yeah. Oh, they got shot down. Well, maybe, maybe not. So much sexual tension. Someone call the hotline. What? What are you doing? That's what I've been wanting to do. Whoa. She's like, he is an idiot. What? You see these two, right? Have they made you watch those threshold kids? Because that shit's crazy as well. Oh, God. Here we go. Phone home, bitch. Oh, also F. Hold on. Don't kill this guy. I'm trying to F him. All right. Oh, I needed help with that, too. Whoa. I'm going to move back here. That guy blew up a whole wall! Oh, this will get him. Oh, my or- Oh! What the ding dong deadly dicks! What the- The things I'm picking up are too big to throw at this guy. There we go. How are you still alive, you big son of a bitch? Oh my god! Everything, everything. Look at all these clocks. I think you can find a way around. Uh, what if it involves climbing these clocks? I was gonna do it anyway, but what if that's the key? Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Let's climb some clocks. We're gonna be weird. Let's get real weird with it. So, you came down here for an altered item? The anchor, yeah. Length is said to be a simple item to treat. But the power of that thing has. I I've never seen anything like it. Could you tell me more about the anchor? I'd love to know more. Oh, give me a sec. Jasper Post Box. Agents arrived in the town of Jasper Crossing, Arizona, after the communications department intercepted multiple phone calls to local authorities regarding frozen people in the streets. Four of the five dispatched agents became paralyzed upon arriving at the scene. Additional assessment teams were dispatched. Variations of identification formulas were tried with ineffectual results. Agents resorted to using aerial photography to study the positioning of the paralyzed victims. Soon after, agents discovered the event's epicenter, to be the local post office. Unaffected agents cleared the area of all paralyzed citizens, animals, and bureau personnel before beginning to study the item. Agents deemed susceptible to the item were tasked with interviewing and re-informing the public away from the site. 
The item was soon placed in a transport vehicle manned by unaffected agents. Air travel had been deemed too dangerous given the item's effect. Numerous reports of temporary paralysis were reported by civilians along the truck's route from Arizona to New York City. New York City? Remember that? Remember the salsa commercials? No? Okay. Oh, are you? Nope, that guy's dead. I was gonna try, dude. I was gonna try. All right, the escort continues. Is this a? That's O'Neill. Shit. No one else got out. Am I gonna have to watch out for a a giant anchor that's gonna try and kill me? I'm just gonna shoot him. <laughs> I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna shoot him. Oh, my, what? All right, let's kill his friends first. All right, this guy, he's gonna get a clock. And then that. Woo! Okay, we got guys up top. Can I get up to them this way? I don't even want to take the chance of leaving. There's the stairs. There's the stairs. I'm coming, dude. I got this. Boom. I have a stool sample. <laughs> That's a weird thing to say to someone. <laughs> That's a weird thing to say to someone. But it was a, stool, it was a stool joke, so here we are. Wow, I'm getting a lot of stuff. I'm also expecting to be attacked by an anchor. Arctic Queen Supplemental Materials. Oh, this is the continuation. Can you tell us why you left your building that day? I was running out to get eggs. There was a corner store on 30th. That's why I left Michael there on his own. Knew I wouldn't be gone long. He was drawing at the table when I left. Had his crayons out happy. The building came down when I was a block away. I ran back, started digging. City workers found Mikey later. Besides the fridge, the drawings hadn't come off. Tons of brick fall on it, and those drawings are still there. How does that happen? You kept the refrigerator after the accident? Why? It still had his drawings. God must have kept them safe for a reason, right? I get home from work and stare at them all night. I was in a bad way back then. Why did you sell the fridge with your son's drawings on it? They got stuck to it or something. I thought about cutting them off, those magnets, but maybe it was better I didn't hold on to them, you know? Gotta move on, everyone says. What's my fridge got to do with the building collapse anyhow? So is the assumption here that when her son died, she spent all that time staring at his drawings on the fridge and it, like, sucked up the energy? The question I have is, was it an AWE before the collapse? I don't think so, but I don't know. I'm just worried I'm going to have to deal with these things. Am I going to meet that fridge? They're setting up a lot of things that if I don't meet them, <laughs> meet them. If that fridge doesn't play a part of the third act, I'm going to be so mad. This is so silly. I love these clocks everywhere. The one over here, yes. Okay. Down we go. And I'll check the bottom floor. See what's around. We got a generator. We got the. That safe room is where the older guy recorded us. We sealed the door on the way out. We couldn't let it get out into the bureau. I'll need to come deal with that altered item later. Oh if no! Safe from now. Wells could get hurt. Oh no! You want me to come back? We locked it tight. Come on, we need to get back to Harwood. Hold on, let me check the bathrooms. 
You never know. Sometimes there's fun stuff in here. Like a broom. Cleaning can be fun. Okay. Uh, and then we'll go across. Mm, actually, we'll go over here. That's where we came from. This is a bunch of ooh, useful things. Nice. So there's an anchor in the guy. There's so much extra stuff to... This is unpleasant. This part is unpleasant. Oh, can you imagine walking on these? Can you imagine? So where do I need to go? I guess we had to go up. And then this way. Up over this stuff and out. <laughs> this is ridiculous. At first I was like, oh, that's silly. Those are some fun clocks. And now I'm just like, this is too much. Clock on clock violence. When it was clear we couldn't contain the altered item, Horowitz ordered a retreat. We got out, but Hiss was waiting for us. I took Horowitz to the motel court and went back for the others. They always are. That was brave of you. Another men's room. It's my job. Another men's room. Oh, wait, ladies' room. Oh, 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 wasn't paying attention. Got it. All right, we're unlocked. So at least I can come here and then go back to that weird room when the time comes. And I assume get punched in the face by an anchor. Or whatever. Okay, Mr. Dead Dog, what do you think of this? You know that airplane we brought in? Like, the actual, proper airplane? Guess who they made catalog every individual piece of that plane to be examined for? Suspected altered status. I had to count every bolt, nut, and piece of non-connected metal. And that's just on the exterior of the damn thing! Do you know how many pieces of hardware it takes to make an airplane? I do! I do! That person went crazy. And had to be put down. They were later terminated. With a pink slip. Almost out of the threshold. Mm, you had to say it like that, didn't you? Ah! All right. Oh, that was it? What the hell is that down there? It appears to be awful. Mm -mm, child. It's too dark in here. Let me generate some power. <laughs> that was so cool to be able to see their shadow to do that. Man, graphics, you are the coolest. Oh, well, we're going, we're actually going down here. Is this going to take me to the red area? Because I am not prepared. Ooh. Ah, what the? Did I get that? I hope so. Are we, are we done again? I'm just picking up stragglers now. I collected one remote thought. This dude and his level 9 clearance. You lucky son of a... Am I jealous? A little bit jealous, yeah. Uh oh, I am overloaded on mods. Okay, uh, loadout. Weapon mods. Let's take a look. What do I have? A bunch of fun things. This is a level 1. Do I have a level anything higher than level 1 damage boost? The answer is a straight no. Accuracy plus 10. I mean, accuracy's not an issue. Not for me, it ain't. Um, let's deconstruct this. 
Let's deconstruct this. And... Mm, or some other low, low bees I can deconstruct. Yeah, we'll deconstruct that. I need to clear up some space. Zoom. I gotta get that precise zoom. Okay, we'll deal with all that in a little bit. Come on. Oh, that was the door I couldn't get in. Okay. Horowitz should still be there. Now, how the hell did we get out of here? This control point right here? We're going to be okay? Let's go. Oh. <laughs> That's right. We have to go over to the... The hell? What is that noise? I thought it was like a good siren. Alarm. Hold on. Something's wrong with them. Shit. Horowitz. Oh, God. No. Oh, no! We could have been friends, Horowitz. We could have been friends. Now I have to take out the hiss trash. That's right, run away, you hiss bastard. Butt shot, butt shot. Can I take this painting? No. Nope. But I can't use the floor. I'm gonna mop the floor with them. Oh, garbage day. Oh, garbage day two. Electric garbage loot. Whoop, oh, floor two. I took it off the floor again. Uh, uh, storage one. The restoraging. Uh, keyboard. Type this. I have to stop. I have to stop. Too much of my energy is going to be very bad. I should talk to Wells. Make sure he's okay. I'm not gonna lie. For a minute, I was lost. I couldn't figure out how we got back here. But I guess, again, the light uh, switch thing doesn't take you to an alternate dimension it takes you to another place within the building that i suppose he probably had the key card for sorry, i don't man. know thanks and thanks for coming to get me horowitz's hra must have been damaged in the threshold guy never put himself first at least the anchor altered item is still locked away down in the clocks i hope it rots down there that altered item needs to be dealt with before it hurts anyone else i should go back down and contain it Head to the executive sector, Wells. They could use a medic. Thank you, Director. I'll go see what good I can do there. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boots! We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots! Out of that time of video games. Bring the strippers and boots! Oh, thank God, I don't need pants now. Hey, JC! What are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a professional broadcast. Yeah, now uh, sing music. It's a professional broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots. It's a professional broadcast. Now here's to ask and answer one simple question. It's a professional broadcast.